It's a one-year warranty on all our compressors, and there's no different with this one. Well, the nice thing about it, oilless, is that it's maintenance-free. You take it out of the box, you plug it in, you don't have to check the oil. Hey, what's happening? Barnaby here. So you want to know more about the Roll Air Hot Dog Compressor. It's a one-horsepower affair, oilless motor, induction motor, and there is a difference between the motors on compressors. We're going to talk to Dan Fox about that because you are the national sales manager for Roll Air. And what we like to do at Tool Select, Dan, is put tools like this into the hands of real people, have them check it out, tell how it behaved in their world, but also invite folks like you onto the set because you can fill us in on the whys and wherefores of the design, who you think it's intended for, the technical stuff, right? Mm -hmm. So first and foremost, let's start at who it's intended for, who is the user of this? Well, the main feature of this compressor is the fact that it's really quiet. Yeah. So the inside trim carpenters love it because they can take it on remodel jobs. If the homeowner's own home, they don't hear the loud noise of a typical high-speed compressor. Mm -hmm. And we get it at low speed, 1,700 RPMs, and two pistons. It gives you 2.35 CFM, so mm -hmm. you can run one, two, maybe three trim guns, mm -hmm. even a, a roofing gun or two if you wanted to. Yeah. Um, but it's low speed, so that's what keeps it quiet. Okay. I'm like a kid in a candy store going to monkey with the switch. Let's see how quiet it is, right? All right, so in the literature you say about 60 dB. You go online, you say how loud is 60 dB. They say about a conversation. Mm -hmm. It's actually a little quieter than conversation because I don't have to talk over it, right? Huh. That's what makes it so good for inside work. It's, it's, it's ideal for that. Okay, and let's talk about the fact that it's oilless. What is that as a differentiator in a buying decision? Because some have oil, some are oilless. Let's talk well, about it. Well, the nice thing about it, oilless, is that it's maintenance free. You take it out of the box, you plug it in, you don't have to check the oil. It, if it runs on an angle, some guys like to put it on the roof, you don't mm -hmm. have to worry about it running out of oil for that purpose. Also for cold starting in the wintertime, just like a car, if it's outside and you keep it outside in the garage or whatever and you go to start it up, the oil's thick. Yep. You got a small motor like that, it's really hard for it to start. The fact that it's oilless, there's no, there's no oil to, 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 to gum up and be, and be thick. Okay, well, let's uh, talk then about the uh, universal versus induction, right? Because there are two different motor configurations that are going to appear on compressors. This one is induction. Is that better? That is better, yeah. A universal motor, what you would typically find on a vacuum cleaner or a blow dryer, um, maybe has 150, 200 hours. Mm -hmm. This machine has a uh, induction motor and can get around 1,500 to 2,500 hours. Okay, getting back to the start, you were gonna reference this valve right here. Right, this is a cold start valve we put on here. So besides the oilless, when this starts up in the morning, it releases a little bit of head pressure so that it's not working against itself. So mm -hmm. it's easier to start. It draws less amps. This machine only draws eight amps, so you can actually run it on an extension cord. Okay, and then this guy is a bit of electronics, right? So mm -hmm. what's the job here? Well, on a compressor, the professional contractor knows that you need to turn your compressor on and off with the on-off switch so it unloads the head pressure. As opposed to just disconnecting the extension cord. Absolutely. Yeah. But the homeowner doesn't typically know that. And right. since this is kind of uh, a crossover compressor for us, yeah. we put an electronic solenoid valve on there. So if it's running and they pull the plug, it does unload the head pressure. Okay. That's cool. And, you know, we put this out uh, to be tested. And one of the things that our tester said was that it just feels solid. So let's talk about what you put into the frame and also everything about it. Is it just a long lasting compressor based on componentry? Uh, that and the fact that we put a roll cage around it. I mean, mm -hmm. there's a lot of compressors out there that you can buy, but you drop something on it and you destroy the pump, you might as well go buy a new compressor. Right. We put the roll cage on here to protect all the most important components on the, on the unit. Yeah, okay, and so let's talk about the warranty on it because everybody goes to the bottom line on that, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a one year warranty on all our compressors and mm -hmm. there's no difference with this one. Okay, customer service? Customer service, we have an 800 number. We have uh, uh, service centers throughout the, the United States. They can mm -hmm. call our 800 number and find the, the closest one to them. Okay, you know, I always try to uh, channel the person watching the video, and at the head of it, I think a lot of people, they say, Roll Air. Haven't heard a lot about the company, and so for that, what we've done is we interviewed Mike Kelly, who's the VP of Roll Air, and what we call a one-on-one, -on -one, and he took us through the history of the company and why it is worthy of someone's consideration. So let's talk about it. Where do you buy it? Because you don't get it in big box stores, right? right. You're going to find it at a tool distributor that sells to the professional contractor. We don't sell in the box houses, and we do that on purpose. Okay, and so ballpark me on the price, because I think everybody thinks if it's a pro tool, it's going to come with a big pro price tag. Where does this sit? Uh, around two hundred and fifty dollars, yeah. and you can buy it and not only at the distributor but online as well. Okay, good information. So again, manufacturer show off, real user review, one on one. You're invited to look at all of those. 
pieces of content because at the end of the day, you want to know exactly what you're getting into when you buy something, right? And therein lies the beauty of toolselect.com.